everybody, it is I, Mr. Charlie Murray, and welcome back to the Jedi Knight episode. I have no freaking idea. I've gone too far, but I have no freaking idea because I've not been keeping count because I've been going off and on, off and on, off and on, off and on. This is buggy. This thing here, you can tell. I, I didn't think that this was a phase I could go into until, of course, I was able to just sort of like walk in. I'm thinking, oh, okay, because as you can see there, it's red. But if you put it on like a weird angle at some point, it's like I was able to walk past here and it turned green. I wonder if it would do that now. Uh, no, no. You might have seen it go green a second ago, but yeah, you can see like the little green um hexagon thingies. But anyway, um, so last time. We needed to find Elena Hart because she killed, I forgot his name, but yeah, she's got the death mark and she's heading to House Thule to, well, uh, let's just read. Possibly kill Duke Horace Thule and sabotage the peace process. So there we go, going to kill him, yes, because I'm totally paying attention to the story. Don't worry, I am. I don't know if I am or not. Hi, how you doing? Oh, of course, yeah, I did my gear and all that now and I'm a bit... Bit annoyed because I forgot to do the bloody helmet. I did everything else, well, apart from the focus, because of course it's really difficult to get a um, a modifiable focus offhand thing. At least I can't anyway. If you can tell me where to get one, I have no idea. But I couldn't find one, so I just had to go with the one which is what we got, which is you know strong in itself anyway. It's not too bad. Um, but I put a color crystal in this one because I hadn't done that in the past. Stupid me. Um, Right, so we go this way. When we're back at the die. ship, don't run off to practice your lightsaber forms. I'd like to chat. Well, the thing Important. is, I really, I really don't know if I want to chat because I've said this in the past. I don't really want to be doing the companion stories for the Jedi. I really should, just for your benefit. But I've done it once before, and it means I'd have to grind all of my companion gifts onto companions which I've already done the story for in my own personal time. That's the reason why I don't want to. It's just, it's going to cost me too much time and too much money and it's just... Oh! I don't want to! But they're going to choke, so enjoy choking. Oh, I've got one enemy away from doing the bonus mission. Don't mind if I do! Lovely! How much did I get there? I didn't really... I think I went from there to there. If you were even looking down at my experience. Well, you probably weren't. But there we go. Hi! Yeah, you gonna attack me? No, because apparently, according to your uh, field of view, you can't even see me. No idea why. Um, I should probably rebuff myself. And hi! Be reasonable, Duke. Your calls for peace are misguided, unnecessary. Yeah, Duke Lord Nukem. Lord wants what's best for House Thule: unconditional victory. Not unconditional and love. And all he asks is that I betray Organa. <gasps> Who the skies are you? I've got to say, your life is in danger. Duh! That woman isn't your ally. She's marking you for death. Marking me? I don't understand. It's a trick. Organa sent her to kill you. Uh, Be no. warned. I am prepared to kill you. Lord Nefarid trained me to fight a Jedi. What As about two win? Jedi? Ha! Guards, defend Invisible the lightsaber. But he's the Duke. He should be able to do it all by himself. I'd like to chat in private. Well, bear in mind on the ship, it is literally just me and T, me, you and T7 at the moment of time. So, um, and I'm pretty sure that I could power down T7. So, yeah, I mean, I don't. I, well, to be honest, I don't even think T7 would even would even want to. You know, just yeah. You must kill me. At least tell me why. I'm not gonna kill you. I'm here for you, fool. Not that it matters. No one will escape Lord Nefarid's purge. You're both dead, just like everyone scrabbling for peace. As the last person marked Jedi, you'll be the first to fall. If I'm going to die, I'll make sure you go with me. Don't expect me to beg for my life. We're past that now. If you're hoping to remove that mark on you, don't. I've just rendered the targeting device non-functional. Then we've heard enough from you. Ooh. Blasted woman has doomed us both. Unless we work together. What do you mean we? You need help from an Imperial lackey. Correction. An Imperial lackey who knows where Lord Nefarid's hiding. I knew it would be wise to keep tabs on that Sith. Disgusting little men like him are always up to something. 
He's using a mountain tank. bunker as a base. I'll give you the coordinates. Kill him if you can. Should have known working together meant I'd take all the risk. I dare say you're better equipped to face a Sith than I am. I'm leaving for the spaceport. I'll try to outrun the death mark in case you fail. But first, this traitor dies. Uh, yeah. My only regret is you knocked her unconscious. Quick what? and painless. Much better than she deserved. And the Jedi Council worries about me going to the dark side. Oh, stop Nefarid, for both our sakes. Kara? 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 Get, get, get back here. Get, stop moving around. Kara? I am the dark side. Ah, we got a message. I wonder who it's from. Master Orgus. The Deathmark device is destroyed, but I was scanned by it. Darth Angrel's apprentice is targeting me. I'm on my way to his stronghold. Where are you? Too far to help. I misled you back at the camp. I haven't been searching for the apprentice. I've been hunting Darth Angrel, and I just found his cruiser. You lied to me! I thought Jedi were supposed to be honest. Didn't want you following me. Someone has to save Alderaan. The cruiser's at the edge of the system, outside the reach of planetary sensors. It's about to jump for hyperspace. This may be our only shot at stopping him. I'm boarding that cruiser. Just wanted someone to know. So you're you telling can... me... You're telling me that you're having me look in the right places and all the wrong places in the right... in the... Damn it, I ruined that joke. Maybe I can find a way to avoid the death mark. Join you out there. From what you've told me, neither of us has much time. This is how it has to be. Stop Angle's apprentice. Save Alderaan. May the force be with you. Orgus out. What's the point? It's gonna be blown up in 3,000 years time. Wow. Just went through a tree there. Just gonna point that out, Thranta. You just went through a tree. We should be hurtling towards the ground right now. But, you know, whatever. You got this, bro. You got this. Well, this isn't really much of a hideout, is it? It's just the base. Because again, it's all about that base. I'm sorry, I keep doing that. I just You're I, fine. it's so tempting. Wait, where the why why am I why am I even up here? I need to be down there. Damn it. Oh I mean I guess on the plus side I'm about to do the bonus mission. So yeah, see how far we get. When we get to level 31? Most likely not. But and I think we'll be close. Yeah, I leave a car about a and a half to go. That's not too bad. Right, where am I actually going? I was I don't know why I came up here. I need to actually go uh, through there. Silly, silly Charlie. Ooh. Well, that was weird. Lights were just appearing as I was walking. Did they do it again? Ooh. They turn on when I... That's... That's very weird. <laughs> I've never seen that happen in a game before. Unless that's just sort of like a technical hitch and they're there. meant to be on. Good as new. Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, okay, yeah. If you move the camera, they turn on, and then when you look away, they turn off. So, I think that's just a bit of a glitch. They're supposed to be on. Don't buy it, you nearly impressed me there, then! You truly are a stubborn one. Won't be satisfied until you've completely inconvenienced me, will you? Prepare to die. I won't be satisfied until I hear your dying breath. You're much too passionate for a Jedi. Ever consider you're on the wrong side? My master is transmitting the most amusing hollow message right now. You really should watch it with me. Assaulting my cruiser alone. Very careless of you, Augustine. It's not too late, Angrel. Do the right thing for once. Surrender. Pity you didn't bring your student. I could kill you both. Tell me, Jedi. Are you afraid to die? There is no death. There is only the Force. If there is no death... Oh, where is my yeah. son? Right. No! And now I'll finish you. After all, you can't fight what you can't see. I forgot about that, didn't I? <laughs> August was weak. 
Um, nah, I won't, I won't annoy Kira that much. I don't need to see you. I can smell you. I'm starting to like you. What a shame you have to die. Oh, I almost forgot. The Deathmark laser is finally back online. And it's tracking you. Joy. Shouldn't there be debris falling from the ceiling right now at the same time? Because the laser is pra practically going right through the ceiling. So, you know. Oh, laser. Wait, was that... No, I guess, oh, I guess that wasn't. I guess that was just that... Oh, this is the laser. There we go. Okay. Good tracking you got there. Very good tracking. Um, right, right. Where are you? Where's he gone? Where's he gone? Where's he gone? Where's he gone? Oh, I. Oh, what? I can't move. Uh, oh well. Uh, I'm not gonna use her this time because I'm nearly done anyway. Almost. I'm like halfway there. So. Yeah. No. Oh, where's he gone now? Uh. Those are some nice colours though. I like those colours. They're quite nice. Here I am being killed, and I'm talking about the nice colours of a laser. Great professionalism, Charlie. Well done. You're amazing. Hi! And uh, he should be... Damn it! Seriously, you're like 5% away and you decide to run away. Well, I'm just going to stand here, watch the laser, blow up that piece of ground, and then fade away, and then wait for you to come and attack me again. Whoa! What'd you chuck me away for? How dare you? Anyway, you're dead. <laughs> With one hit. One bloody hit. Uh, destroy the death mark targeting, targeting computer. It'd be nice if it could still actually target you whilst you're making your way to the computer. Where am I going? I'm going the wrong way again! Oh, hi! Well, I just killed a Sith Lord. Do you really think you can stand up against me? I don't think so! And, of course, they'd all attack me before I could even uh, destroy the bloody laser! Well, you're dead anyway. Destroy the laser before it kills me! Oh, it's going to take five seconds? Ugh! Could have killed me by now! Target coordinates accepted. Oh, it blew itself up. Oh, wait. Oh, no, it blew the targeting computer. Okay. Wait. How the hell did that not kill me? Because I was still in the blast radius. So, yeah, I am now in the crater. I made this crater. Yes, I did. And I'm going to stand in the crater whilst I'm in the cutscene. The death mark has been destroyed. Your people are safe. I will inform Organa Palace immediately. We are forever in your debt. Duke Thule reports you executed the spy Elena. I wish she could have stood trial for her crimes. Nah. Her testimony might have turned the other houses firmly against the Empire. I put justice before politics. So should you. I see your point. Please, forgive my abruptness, but I am needed elsewhere. This threat is ended, but the war goes on. I hope someday Alderaan knows lasting peace. Farewell, Master Jedi. We should head back to the ship. Tell General Varsuthra about Master Orgus. Don't worry. You'll know everlasting peace on Alderaan. Don't worry. In 3,000 years' time when you're blown up. There you go. You'll have everlasting peace then. Sorry, was that too soon? I say too soon. Isn't that too early? Ah, uh, sorry, that was a terrible joke. Hello, hello, hello. General, the death mark has been destroyed, and I have news about Master Orgus. Darth Angrel broadcast Orgus's execution over the holonet of the body floating in space for us to find. Whoa! The Republic shuttle has just recovered the remains from the edge of the Alderaan system. I'm sorry. That is an assy thing to do, seriously. You were friends a long time. Not many of us left from the old days. Orgus was. He was the best. He sacrificed himself for a purpose. Somehow, he planted a tracking beacon on Angrel's cruiser without the Sith realizing it. Every time Angrel's ship drops out of hyperspace, we know where. Orgus got the last laugh. If Orgus had let me go with him, he'd still be alive. I could have killed Angrel. Maybe, maybe not. Regardless, the odds favor us next time. Stand by. Report coming through. Angrel is on the move. We've just picked up the tracking signal in the Euphrates system. That agro world supplies nearly half of Carson's food. I'm scrambling the fleet, but you're closer. Maybe the Empire will send forces to help us take down Angrel? The Empire's disavowed Darth Angrel. That doesn't mean they'll help us. 
Any damage to Euphrates' food production could cripple the Republic. One warship can only destroy so much. Tell that to Terrus. Transmitting Euphrates coordinates. Good hunting. Travel to Euphrates. Righto. Should we do this now before we finish up? Yeah, I think we shall. Ooh, level 31. Lovely. I think, yeah. Let's 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 go do this before we finish this episode. Because of course it's been a while since I've done a Jedi Knight episode. Because you know what I'm like. I say I'm going to start recording again, and then I just sort of stop, and then I start again, and then I stop, and then I start again, and then I stop. Because yeah, Euphrates is one of the Republic's primary agro worlds, a lush planet with a temp temperate temperature, well temperate whatever atmosphere and especially rich soil due to significant volcanic activity over 20 millennia ago. Nearly half of the Republic capital's food supply is grown and harvested on Euphrates, earning it the nickname Coruscant's Granary. 16 million farmers and food technologists oversee the sustainable agricultural production across the planet's five continents. Ah, lovely. We're going to go do some farming now. Aww. It's going to be a peaceful place. You just watch. Uh oh! I think I broke it! <laughs> Oh well, the good thing is I can now I now have that cutscene of the ship just going into space. So if I ever wanted to use that now, I can. Yeah, although it'll have like the music of do 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 So, you know. Wait. Um Well Oh bloody hell! This is what happens when you rush to go down to the planet. You forget that you need to use your bloody intercom. Shut up! Shut up! I'm mad right now. I need to use my intercom because I'm that mad. No sign of Darth Angrel, but Euphrates. I saw this planet once, with Master Kawix. It used to be green. Sensors detect minimal life signs. General, Euphrates I've arrived at Euphrates. World. There's no sign of Angrel, but the planet... See for yourself. Receiving your sensor readings. Stand by. Euphrates' atmosphere looks like it's on fire. What could have done that? Damage consistent with designs recovered on Ord Mantel. A desolator weapon. If Darth Angrel has a weapon that can do this, the Republic is doomed. There's virtually no vegetation left. Even the oceans are boiling. Euphrates had millions of citizens. Whole continents of farmlands. All that life extinguished. The scale of this is... it's unthinkable. Getting an emergency transmission. It's faint, coming from the far side of the planet. Republic Vessel, do you copy? This is Medical Frigate Daybreaker. We're under attack! Imperial Commandos have boarded us! Help! It's one of ours. The crew may know what happened here. We should focus on Angrel, not his Commandos. That ship may have sensor readings of the Desolator. Invaluable data. We won't get here in time. You need to save that ship! Hurry! Let's hope we can get there in time. Plotting an intercept course now. Strap yourselves in. Um, I was gonna say, is that supposed to be something here? Well, destroyed planet, it looks quite pretty. What do you think? Yeah, that's nice. I was wondering, if the planet's been destroyed, where the hell were we ending up on? Um, on the planet, I have no idea, but yeah, I guess we'll. We're gonna know now, and that's probably why there was no planet when I was going down to the planet, because of course it's been destroyed and there's no cutscene to go down to the planet like you just saw there. Because the cutscene you just saw there, where the ship was going to the planet, was the cutscene going to the planet. Get what I mean? Yeah, yeah. You understood every word I said there. Good, good. And this is where the fun begins. Obtain an explosive device. Um, couldn't you guys have exploded it for me? Why have I got to do everything around here? God, bit here. For Less than a minute, and already I'm doing all the work. There we go, I've destroyed it. Are you gonna come join me? No? No? Alright. Um, well, I mean, there's you, there's you two, but just you two. But, okay. My force. I would rather not. Thanks, though, Kira. Oh, God. Oh, this is gonna be one of those missions where I'm gonna have to kill everybody to do, actually, to do the mission. Oh, great. I love these sort of missions. You know how it's like a bonus mission? Like, oh, it's optional. You don't have to do it. Yes, you do. But hey, 
experience, I guess. And the last one. There we go. Reach the bridge. And kill five more people along the way to do the bonus mission. Alright. Give me those spear points. Thank you very much. Um, right. And to the bridge we go. Defeat. Oh, God. There's more. Seriously. Ooh, the planet is pretty. Look at it. Oh, so we're not actually on the planet then. Okay. I guess we can't. Because, like, I don't know. 300. Because I was thinking to myself, shouldn't this ship if it's on the planet, be, I don't know, melting right now? <laughs> That's what confused me about, yeah, we're not on the planet. I should have paid attention to that, because you know me, I don't pay attention! I subtly pay attention, but I don't fully pay attention. Ha! You can't even kill me, you Sith Assassin! Call yourself an assassin! Ah, right, hello! That was the last of the Imperials. You're safe now. Not a minute too soon. Those commandos weren't taking prisoners. I still can't believe what happened to Euphrates. When we arrived, an Imperial ship was attacking the planet. I've never seen anything like it. Euphrates was trapped inside an energy field. Some starships tried to flee, but their engines failed before they could leave the atmosphere. No one escaped. Every ship that tried crashed back onto the surface. Wow. How did your ship come under attack? We tried to run, but Imperial boarding pods overtook us. I saw Euphrates' atmosphere catch fire. Horrific destruction. Flames consumed the planet. Everything turned to smoke and ash in seconds. That's never gonna leave you, is it? I'll say one thing for Darth Angrel. He's efficient. So efficient, there's nothing left to do here. That may not be true. Our sensors detect faint life readings on the planet's surface. Possible survivors. Seriously? The one left on that planet is as good as dead. If we go down there, we can provide food, water, shelter, and medicine. It's our duty. The energy field surrounding Euphrates will destroy your ship's engines. You won't be able to leave. You could hold out a long time in this ship. Long enough for the Republic to make Euphrates safe again. We're the only hope those people have. Every second counts. Please, he'll listen to you. Talk to him. Why would he listen to me? I've only known him for like two minutes. It's not that I don't want to help, but I have a family to think about. This ship carries combat-grade Colto packs, battle adrenals, you name it. Talk her out of this crazy idea. You'll have your pick of our supplies. Well, I've got to decide now. I've pinpointed the strongest life signs. We can land immediately. Uh. <laughs> the captain is a crook. <laughs> Listen to me. I'm a Jedi. If there was anyone alive down there, I'd sense it. There's nothing you can do for Euphrates. Let it go. Let if it go. The Empire's restarting the war will be needed out there. You're right. I'm clutching at false hope. Excuse me. Here. This will unlock the ship's med stores. I'll just report them as lost during the boarding action. You did the right thing. Thank you. Alright, where are the med stores? Should we get some myself some loot? Oh, it's all the way over there. Fine. Alright, give me some loot. Thanks. Lovely. Oh. I don't even know what I got. Alright, let's go use my uh, holo terminal then. Right, let's use the holo terminal and then the next episode will probably be in about uh, four months from now, yeah? 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 Sounds good? Yeah? The Daybreaker is secure, General. The crew witnessed what Angrel did here. The ship's captain just transmitted sensor logs to the fleet. We've seen what we're up against. Small consolation. Angrel's next attack will undoubtedly be more direct. If he uses it on one of the core worlds, it will be catastrophic. An understatement. He could murder trillions. I'll contact the Galactic Senate and put every Republic world on... Wait. We're getting another emergency alert from Typhon. Relaying it now. Under attack by Darth Angrel. Launching defense fighters. Angrel's battlecruiser deploying energy weapon. Our ship can't escape Typhon's atmosphere. We're trapped. That explains why Angrel left Euphrates so quickly. He's already chosen his next target. With all that tactical intelligence, how could you not see this coming? 
There are more tactically advantageous targets to strike. Angro's acting from emotion, not logic. The Republic fleet's in hyperspace. What? By the time it's redirected to Typhon, it'll be too late. The Desolator needs time to work. The Jedi may be trapped on Typhon, but you're not. You could board Angro's battlecruiser. Disable the weapon before it fires. Sorry, but if I were Angro, think about it now. Yes, it would be incredibly logical to go to Typhon and destroy all of the Jedi. Just pointing that out to you. There are other Jedi not on Tython. Send them to help me. I'll gather all the reinforcements I can find, but it'll take time. I'll use the sensor logs to find the Desolator's weak point. Contact us when you're aboard Angra's warship. May the Force be with you. Wow, the Force is clearly not with the Jedi on Tython right now, because otherwise this wouldn't be happening. So anyway, thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. And I will see you in, yeah, like four months. Yeah, because you know me, I'm not very consistent with these uh, uploads. And I will see you next time. And a farewell to you.